Hi, I'm Enito Kediji from Nigeria. Um, I'm a young woman from Africa. <laughs> Hello, my name is Alejandro Cacaccia. I'm from Argentina. I'm part of this Mason cohort at the Harvard Kennedy School. Hi everyone, I'm Crystal. I have been in the development space for about 10 years. It really resonates with my personality, which is deeply curious, um, compassionate, um, wanting to learn, wanting to help, wanting to support. I came to the Kennedy School because I'm looking for uh, different ways, tools and frameworks and how I can improve uh, social outcomes, uh, particularly in Africa where I'm most passionate. The Mason program is the oldest international program here at the school and the idea is to gather leaders from all different regions of the world. The whole amazingness of this experience was the capacity to adapt the capacity to get to know other people, the capacity to see beyond your own self what others are doing. I knew from the beginning that the people who were going to be here were carefully selected to be part of this cohort because they are special, because they're doing something amazing in the world. Coming to Harvard has been um, one of possibly the best decisions I've ever made in my life. It was really tough making this decision at this point, but I'm glad I did. Um, I've met so many amazing people. Um, it's been a humbling experience hearing their stories, um, all the obstacles that they have had to overcome before getting to this point in their, in their career and their lives. So far we've been through a five-week summer program, having some lectures, working on quantitative skills, on economics, discussing race, racism and colonialism, discussing climate change. Beyond the, um, the, the, the insights and the knowledge that we get from professors, right, during classes, I think one of my, my major highlights has been interacting with the different um, um, students out of class. I knew I was coming to Harvard for the amazing academic reputation, but I knew I was really going to enjoy the networking. We all strive for change. There is something that motivates each of us to uh, pursue change in our countries. Um, what I'm most um, energized about is mostly, you know, my classmates. You know, just seeing the optimism, the enthusiasm, um, the energy, and just the diversity of perspectives. I've already learned so much. Um, I look forward to the year ahead. I think um, looking at how we can uh, break down biases, um, looking at how we can find common ground and how we can build a global community of change makers so we can go back out to our communities um, and change the world. Thank you. Aww. Hi. This is Gandam Chandradu. Hola, this is Erika from Ecuador. My name is Jamil and uh, I'm from Nigeria. My name is uh, Shabri Nair. I decided to come to Harvard. At the beginning, I had really high expectations about what was, what was this thing that we were doing, why we were trading our lives to come back and being students. We're here with our bikes, with our backpacks, putting all of our savings in here. And you know what? Uh, I like what we're feeling now. What I love about being at the Harvard Kennedy School is the ocean of talents, explorers, and people who want to make a difference that I have met. Studying in Harvard is a dream uh, right from, you know, very childhood. Coming from that background and studying in the, the best of the best universities in the world is the dream I had uh, entertained for such a long uh, period. There are many moments when you sit with a group of people from around the world, white or black, brown or yellow, developed or developing. You tend to start looking at things as an you versus me, as an us versus them, as a north versus south. But we reached across the aisles. Across the room are so many special people. Um, and maybe what I should be thinking about 
is how we build a solidarity of all these special people who have one thing in mind, to save the world. Uh, I'm meeting an extraordinary group of people, and not only because they have fantastic careers, because they have this soul, this, this spirit of empathy, of resilience. I'm Sebastian Fernandez. I am from Mexico City and I am a Mason Fellow MCMPA class of 2023. Hi, um, I'm Julia Lamesh. Uh, my name is Neda Hassan. My name is Leonardo Civinelli Tornel da Silveira. My name is uh, Vela Pimamba. I am so glad I came here. It was a hard decision for me to take. I'm actually so privileged and happy to be here at HKS uh, with um, all of you guys. Like with any place, um, you know, the campus is beautiful, the building is amazing, uh, the professors are exceptional. I came here because uh, I want to understand how to end intergenerational poverty cycles. I consider myself to be a freedom fighter and a campaigner for justice and human rights. Just being here and sharing the story of Ukraine is extremely important because I'm literally sharing uh, the story of Ukraine with more than 56 countries. Uh, and the reason I, I came to the Kennedy School is precisely because um, my country is going through a historic moment. Poverty transmits from one um, father to son and how can we be fairer to, uh, to the communities, the vulnerable populations, the people who have been uh, denied the right to be uh, empowered. I think my message to the Mason Fellows would be uh, we are here, we are here together, um, but let's not forget where we come from, our countries need us. Let's take all the learnings that we can gather from here and go back to our countries um, and strive for a more equal and just world. I think that anybody who's considering an experience like this should just take a, a, the jump. They are giving us this space to think about the things that we want to do in the future. Are we doing well in our career? What is our why? What is our purpose? So just having this possibility of thinking about what we are, it's an amazing thing. And it's so incredible how this cohort became like a family. We went through all type of issues. Some of the classmates actually had death in their families or create news about giving birth to new, new kids. <sighs> so much happened this year. I think any young person who sees this should give it a shot. You know, whatever you believe in, give it a shot. You know, because in your faith, nothing is determined. You know, so embrace what you've been given and push as hard as you can. Um, so I guess I'm more fatty. Embrace your faith and push as hard as you can. <laughs>